Hi, I'm Rob, we're at Minic. Uh, today we want to look at how to take your A1C from a horizontal drilling position to a 35 degree stitch drilling position. Before we start uh, working on the drill, we want to make sure that we uh, relieve it of all air pressure. And uh, we also want to uh, at least disconnect the hose here so that we can move the cylinder uh, freely. What we're going to do is we're going to uh, adjust the knuckle here um, by moving the pin up to this hole and, uh, and then securing the top, lining it up here to the top hole uh, with an additional pin. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to uh, put the drilling bed in the horizontal position. Uh, we've relieved it of all air pressure and disconnected the air. We've taken the, disconnected the hose uh, from the valve here. And then we're gonna, uh, we're gonna need to support this with a, a crane or a forklift or, or something that can su support the weight. And, uh, and then we're gonna remove this pin. That's gonna be the first step. Okay, so we've got the bed supported and now we're ready to remove the pin from the cylinder rod. Okay, we've removed the pin here and we wanna, we wanna push this back in and put this in a vertical position. Okay, now that we've got this uh, supported, we're supporting both ends. Uh, the next step is we're gonna uh, remove the pin and slide this up and re-pin uh, re it in the second to the bottom hole. Okay, now that we've got the bolt into the second uh, hole, uh, all we have to do is line up the, the top two holes here, um, and you'll need to get a pin from us, uh, part number 7413, and it, uh, it'll just slide in as we put it in. Okay, so now that we have the pin in the second uh, hole up, uh, we retighten the bolt on the back side to make sure that doesn't come out. Uh, we've put the, the slide pin in here, so it's now fixed into position and it's ready. Uh, we can go ahead and remove our supports because that's, that's now locked in the 35 degree uh, stitch position. Um, so the next thing that we're going to do then is remove the chains. We're going to drop the cylinder back down and reinsert the pin back into the top of the the um, eye rod holder and into the anchor. Up a little bit. Okay. Then after we put that pin back in, we want to put the cotter pins uh, back in and bend them so that pin can't come back out. Okay. Now because of the 35 degree pitch, you will lose a couple inches uh, on drilling depth. So if you if you were right at your limits uh, earlier, you may need to get some longer drill steel. Um, also uh, remember. Don't, on, don't use the uh, lift, try to lift this uh, and use the lift valve on your uh, unit because uh, that is locked into position. Thanks for watching and happy drilling. If you have any uh, questions, uh, please call us at Minix.